Hello, this is Chairman Sampson doing an update on COVID-19 on the reservation and what's going on with uh, our health clinic and what's going on out there in the public. So right now I'd like to introduce Donna Brown and let her go over what's going on right at the clinic. Okay, so uh, clinic operations right now, I think as everybody's pretty much familiar with it, we're still doing the pharmacy drive through and we are doing the phone triaging. And we also have our behavioral health who's on call uh, pretty much anytime anybody needs them with all the stress and anxiety right now. You know, everybody keep that in mind that just call the clinic and we will put you in touch with them. Uh, I wanted to give you some information on our cases that we have. We have 14 positive confirmed cases on the reservation right now. And we have nine in the Nixon area, four in Sutcliffe and one in Wadsworth. So, you know, just keep those numbers in mind. It's, our numbers have gone up really quickly in a short amount of time which means that the virus is moving. You know, we, gotta, we really gotta take control of that somehow. But on the upside is, is we have one recovery, you know, that's been discharged to home, so that's an awesome thing. And then we have no deaths, you know, and I think those are some very important numbers there. And I wanted to touch on uh, testing. Well, testing has become a big, a big uh, issue and a big concern with us right now where we are doing testing at the clinic and if you are feeling symptoms or if you know you've been in contact, direct contact with a confirmed case or been in a household, that call the clinic, go over your symptoms, and we will let you know, you know if you can get tested uh, through our facility or if we you know, need to send you into Reno, we can do that too. But give us a call and let us know because we want to make sure that we're, we're touching everybody who needs to be tested at this point. And also, um, if you're tested elsewhere, say at another tribal clinic or in town, and you live on the reservation, we would appreciate if you can give us a call so that we can keep and we can track these numbers as well. Okay, thank you. You know, with, along with this, when we, we look at the amount of cases that have ramped up in the last w week, I'd, I'd say, you know, we got to look at isolation. We got to look at the protocols of staying home. And I don't think that we are following those those uh, protocols because if it wasn't then we wouldn't be ramping up so many of the the new cases here on the reservation so i want to just to reiterate the the, uh, the pro some of the protocols if you have been quarantined stay at home stay at home this is the, the best option uh, don't be going out to the stores uh, uh, if you need things there are protocols in which you all you have to do is reach out to the clinic or tms or uh, some uh, administration and let us know what what you need and we'll try to find out how we can get those products or those things to you we talk about you know those that have uh, that are isolation you know the the group gathering social social gathering we've got to continue uh, uh, moving in that direction you know the, we have so many of the children because they're out of school right now gathering together walking around with one another that's how this this virus uh, it multiplies. That's how it, it's spread by uh, social gathering. We need to be able to, to tell our kids, okay, you know what, you don't need to be running around out there at this time. You know, it's, there's a lot of things that, that are going on out there that, that you know, they, they could bring, they could bring that, that virus back to the house. We've got things that are going on out there that we need to, to put a, a, a stop to, and we're asking you guys to, to uh, stay at home stay at home is is is, is going to how we're going to slow this virus down uh the other thing is uh wearing wearing uh protective uh, uh proper um masks that you know you can you can make them there there's on a website that shows you how to make them we could send that out through social media uh we use the, the social media to get that information out to you and and we're with the hopes with the hopes of, that they're going to share it with everybody and and let them know, hey, this is what's going on on, the, on our reservation, and you know, you just share it out there. Um, and on top of that, you know, we, wearing the, the mask in public now, uh, you know, there's, I know that there's a, the lack of it out there in the friendly area and such, but you know, that's the, for us to stay safe here on the reservation, we need to start masking up. So that's why I encourage you guys to, if you don't have them, you guys can make them, a bandana. Uh, you can, you know, wear a bandana or, or, or what in, in public as long as you, you are masking up. For, that's for your own protection and the pet, protection of the family members when you go back home. Um, yeah, so, you know, just one other thing, just want to remind everybody during this time is to don't forget to be kind. 
to people, okay? And also take care of each other and please wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Yes, uh, and, and going along with that, uh, being kind, our medical providers are extremely working overtime on, on this thing, you know, and you know, when you get to the clinic, you know, uh, uh, you know, I know that we're all stressed during this time, so we need to really uh, check our, our ourselves, you know, and you know, be kind to our, our, our public providers out there, you know, they're working hard, they're on the front lines, and you know, I can't say it enough because, you know, uh, all of the providers throughout the United States, they're working overtime, so, you know, be kind to them, you know, you don't, I know you're stressed at home, staying at home and, and having to, to bear down on all this, what's going on, but, you know, a kind word goes, goes far, you know, they're working on, uh, on behalf of our people, so, and you see them, you know, just uh, let them know that, you know, you appreciate what they're doing, you know, uh, and, and again, just, uh, we just need to be kind to one another, social, social, social gathering, we got to make sure that we're, uh, keeping in with those parameters of not uh, getting, uh, you know, going out and violating curfew or you know, gathering, uh, what, eight, eight now is it? Or ten. Is it still ten? You know, you don't do that. You know, the social distancing is still, what, six feet? Mm -hmm. So we need to continue uh, working in those areas there. So uh, this is our update for today, and we just want to thank you and just hope everybody stays safe out there. And remember, mask up when you go places. Okay, thank you and God bless you. Thank you.